Okay, morning folks. This is a Robins, oh, can you see that? A Robins, um, what do you call it, like a kettle, boiler. I'll show you this and you'll see when you see it. This actually fits on my log burner at the cabin. Uh, when I bought it, I thought, oh great, this was, I don't know what it was, about 45 quid or something like that. Um, I had to put an extra washer on the tap because it's not the best fitting. And I only, I, the first time I ever used it was about 12 months after I bought it. And I want to show you something. Let me see this. Let me zoom in. There we go. Can you see that? There. And that's a leak. I didn't know that when I bought it, and I thought, well, just, you just, I just thought it was the tap, but it's actually, there's a floor. Can you see it? So I'm going to have a go at welding that with those. Welding rods advertise that they weld anything, so we will see. Uh, I'm in the back of my van, but I've got a, a, a fire mat on the floor. You can see that down there. I've used it before. So I'm going to have a go, and it says you can just use an ordinary gas gun. Hence. So we'll give that a go. We'll heat it up. I'll get one of the rods, and we'll see if we can repair it. That's the rods that come. So we're going to pack like that. See, there we go, and it says it welds anything, so we're going to give it very light, it's supposed to be fluxed, it's fluxed as well, so I don't want to damage it, but it's no good as it is, because it keeps leaking, so I don't know whether to take that tap out or not, I suppose I could, couldn't I, let's just have a, I can put some more plumber's tape on that afterwards. Okay, I've no idea, let's give it a go. So, Quite impressive actually because you can just sand that down if it stops the leak it means I haven't wasted a you know a okay all right okay <laughs> let that um, cool Clean it up afterwards. Oh. Get ready, focus. I'll give it a bit of a clean up, so it's cleaned up. I'm going to file it, but before I do that, I'm going to give it a quick water test. Okay. Okay, tap back on. Let's put some water in it and we'll see what happens. Okay, that's half full. <laughs> well, uh, I take it back. It really does work. So something that was actually leaking, you could, you, well, it would used to drip on top of the. Uh, let me get that focus. Come on. It would leak, and you could hear it. It's quite annoying, actually. But that, I mean, you can file it down. But at the end of the day, I don't really care. It's a usable item now, where it wasn't before, really. So yeah, ten out of ten. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up and a like, that would be great. And uh, they really do work. And this is stainless steel, so I didn't think it would, actually. Because the mate at work, he's really, he deals with metal and whatnot, and he goes, oh, you'll have a hard job fixing that, and he refused to do it. Thank you, mate. Done it. Take care. See you in the next one. Just uh, just in case, because you usually get the other one saying you didn't put any water in it. There you go. Okay. All right, take care.